Right, I've left my magical comb. That's, I know all these tracks, by the way. We're up now. We're not far from the air of and Beauty, just through those trees. I just want to go to the gate, that's all. See if there's any purple haze. Right, turn in off for a minute. Right, the plan is then, I've looked, there's, there was no purple haze up on the area of Sunny Beauty. The sky is grey, the sun hasn't come out. I'm a bit disappointed when it's, I bet you it'd be a brilliant sunny day tomorrow. Well, I've got an alternative walk for tomorrow that I'm going to do. I've got an alternative walk. Um... I'm not going to stay in all day. I know I'm cooking the dinner, but I ain't staying in all day. If it's sunny tomorrow, I'm going out again. But I'll do a local walk with no buses. I am disappointed that the only thing that's making up for it, really, is this beautiful greenness. It's making up for the lack of blue. So we've got lots of green instead. Like I said, I've walked here... In all seasons, I've seen these trees naked, no leaves, and I've seen them lush like this. And there are other flowers that do appear in the wood throughout the seasons. Um, the bluebells have had their spell, it looks like that's that, that's that for them. Um, Yeah, I know where I'm going. I won't be going down by the stream, walking that bit today. I'm going to follow, keep on following this track. And, um... I'm going to come out by the pink house and walk through that bit. There is a bit of a repeat, unfortunately. Because I'm not doing the, um, hill fort. I'm not doing the hill fort. That would have been more of a circular. So there is going to be a bit of overlap um, as uh, when I first came to Robert with that stretch I'll have to do it but in reverse so it's quite so bad. It's like a circular radio because you're doing it in the opposite direction. There's lots of tracks you know in these woods that you can follow sometimes I've done it and you can actually walk in the wood and it's a lovely experience actually. Um, it's clearer when there's um, less leaves. So you can see the, the tracks. Um, somebody coming, so I'm just going to turn off a minute. Right, we're going down familiar tracks, but they do all look alike. It does take a while to build up <coughs> an idea of where you are. But if you ever get lost, just keep on a main one. This is coming off a bit now, believe it or not. The main one was over there. So just keep on a main one. This one's going to lead me to a junction in a minute, which I'll then... Which is going to run very close to that one over there. If not, it'll take me somewhere down by the stream. So it doesn't really matter. We can do either. We're going in the right direction. It's just nice to be up in the wood though. I just, I am just a bit disappointed with the weather to be quite honest though. I thought it was going to be warmer. They said it was going to be 18, 20 degrees in the southwest and blue and sunny and it ain't. It ain't. So I'm a bit disappointed from that point of view to be quite honest. So I was expecting it to be, I'm not cold, and I haven't got felt with the need to put a coat or anything like that on. It is, but I'm not warm either. I'm sort of, because I'm walking, it's fine. But I think if you stopped, it wouldn't be so good. I've got a feeling in a minute, I sort of branch around that way, but I know I can go down to the stream if I want. Because they do chop stuff about here, you know. 
and it changes the landscape. Oh, I can just see some people now. Some more people there. Which way are they going? These lovely tall trees, look. It's greenery, know, everyone. Yeah. It's making up and compensating for the lack of blue sky. But we are going down into a valley now where it'll be a bit warmer as well. So there is a stream down the bottom. Um, I was thinking there, had, there was another track, but um, it doesn't really matter. We're still on target for anything. We haven't really got any targets really. It's time is, uh, is could be an issue, but I've already made my mind up. If I'm not going to make the bus my main thing for the rest of this walk, because I haven't for the first half. But if um, we do happen to be by Sanford by four o'clock when the bus comes, then basically we'll get on it. But if it doesn't, I don't mind walking another hour, because that's all it'll be, to cut through on the strawberry line. The sun is trying to come out. Now, this is this track I was thinking of. Now, if we go straight down here, this takes us to the valley and the stream below. This is another way, which I don't think I've done or I've, I've forgotten it. And I haven't done it for a long time. So I'm going down this way. Uh, if you go left there, that takes you right round the Robar Warren. And you can pick up a track there to take you over to the West Mendip Way. Down the road that I did the other week. But we're going to keep on this track now. I can see somebody coming already. Another biker, because they're very fit, these people. Um, so there's the valley down below. The streams below will come out by a stream further down. And I think we're still past the... I don't know if we're past the pink house or not. Yeah, I think we will. I think we'll have to pass the pink house. I don't know if the last time I'd done this one, I just hope it doesn't decide to go up. Oh. It's, oh, it's so nice to meet everyone so friendly when you're out in the wood. Because everyone's breathing pure air. And their brains are clear. And it's nice to do this alternative way. And it's nice to know I've got an option today. I've got an option. I quite fancy, if the sun's going to come out, I quite fancy doing the strawberry line. I've got enough water, I've got food. It's a great possibility I'll do it. There's nothing, there's only the Eurovision Song Contest on tonight. There ain't nothing on telly. And if it's a nice evening and the Bristol buses are so frequent, it seems to me a good way of doing it. I'm videoing, I don't know how bumpy it is. Um, but this is a track I don't... I think if I've done it, it's a long time ago. And uh, I don't actually know if I have done it either. Or I might have done part of it. So it's quite nice to actually do something different as well. I can hear the stream down there, which I've done thousands of times down there. So I'm quite enjoying doing this. Another biker coming, they're quite frequent. Oh. oh. Hi. Good evening. You've got to be young, haven't you, to, to want to cycle up hills all the time. I mean, I wouldn't want to. <gasps> the sun's coming out, everyone. The sun's coming out. <gasps> I can hear the stream. 
I can hear birds. Oh, this is fantastic now. I can feel the warmth already on my head. You're, now it's getting so warm, I think, oh, I wish I had my shorts on. No, it's not that warm yet. I will be getting them out, though. Probably get them out tomorrow. Get the... And I've got a few winter jumpers that can go away now. This one's what I call an in-between one that I've got on. This one um, isn't tight-fitting, so it doesn't suffocate you and keep you warm. Um, but I would say it'd be too hot to wear it. It's handy to have for a, an, an evening. Now, this is a decision, isn't it? Do I go down there and meet the stream or carry on up here? Because this is one way down, I know that. And you cross the stream and join up with the stream down there. And there's an old path, but look. Or do I carry on? What do you think, folks? You can either go down there and join up and walk along there. Or you can carry on there, and I think that'll t take you further up there. Um, I'm going to carry on. I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to carry on, because I know where that goes. That'll take me down. I've got a feeling this track will link up with the one further up. Now, if it starts going up, I'm going to turn back and go down there. I think. I'm going to see. Where it, I can see the path down there and everything. Yeah, I can see where the bikes go. Look. There's a path down there I'll take you down. Let's just see what happens around this corner before we make any <coughs> rapid decisions. This might even come out where I started my walk earlier. We're going to carry on, I think. I don't want to go all the way around though. So if it doesn't turn off, no, it's turning. It is turning. Yeah, look. And we're exploring. We are exploring as well. Yeah, I don't think I've done this for a long time. There's a path going down there, look. <clears throat> These are bikers tracks. That will take you, although you could think they don't necessarily mean they take you down. Now look, if you look at that, it says, no way. I've seen bikes come down there a minute ago. See? N nobody's supposed to do that. That's for a biker. We'll carry on the track, I think. I know where it's going to come out. It's alright, I don't mind doing it though. It's the lower track. Yeah, I know where we're going to come out. We're still heading in the right direction, you see. Of course, if this was half past three, four o'clock now, I would be getting a little bit anxious, I think. Because I know it would be getting on a bit. But I'm out in Robera Warren, which is what I wanted to do. See, I could have followed those boys when they were coming down, but you're not supposed to do that. That's supposed to be for certain riders. So, I, I've, got, I've got this feeling I know where this is coming out. The junction point. And the pink house will be down there somewhere, the pink cottage. I have done it in the past, but you do get used to certain routes. I 
It would have been more straightforward if I just followed the river, you know? Because we are backtracking a bit. We are backtracking, but it doesn't matter. It's all part of the afternoon walk. It's all part of the afternoon walk. And it's nice to do it because I haven't done it for ages. Over and out for a minute. 